brought to you by wikivd.com. Rowan Atkinson Rowan Sebastian Atkinson, CBE, MSc, is an English actor, comedian, and screenwriter best known for his work on the sitcoms Blackadder and Mr. Bean. Atkinson first came to prominence in the BBC's sketch comedy show Not the Nine O'Clock News, receiving the 1981 BAFTA for Best Entertainment Performance, and via his participation in The Secret Policeman's Ball. From 1979, his other work includes the 1983 James Bond film Never Say Never Again, playing a bumbling vicar in Four Weddings and a Funeral, voicing the red-billed hornbill Zazu in The Lion King, and featuring in the BBC sitcom The Thin Blue Line. His work in theatre includes the 2009 West End revival of the musical Oliver. Atkinson was listed in The Observer as one of the 50 funniest actors in British comedy, and among the top 50 comedians ever, in a 2005 poll of fellow comedians. In addition to his 1981 BAFTA, he received an Olivier Award for his 1981 West End theatre performance in Rowan Atkinson in Review. He has also had cinematic success with his performances in the Mr. Bean movie adaptations Bean and Mr. Bean's Holiday, and also in Johnny English and its sequel Johnny English Reborn. He appears as the titular character in Maygray. Early Life Atkinson, the youngest of four brothers, was born in Consett, County Durham, England. On 6 January 1955, his parents were Eric Atkinson, a farmer and company director, and Ella May, who married on 29 June 1945. His three older brothers are Paul, who died as an infant, Rodney, a Eurosceptic economist who narrowly lost the United Kingdom Independence Party leadership election in 2000, and Rupert. Atkinson was brought up Anglican, and was educated at Durham Choristers School, a preparatory school, Street B's School, and Newcastle University, where he received a degree in electrical engineering. In 1975, he continued for the degree of MSc in Electrical Engineering at the Queen's College, Oxford, the same college where his father matriculated in 1935, and which made Atkinson an honorary fellow in 2006, first winning national attention in the Oxford Review. At the Edinburgh Festival Fringe in August 1976, he had already written and performed early sketches for shows in Oxford by the etc. as the review group of the Experimental Theatre Club, and for the Oxford University Dramatic Society, meeting writer Richard Curtis and composer Howard Goodall, with whom he would continue to collaborate during his career. Radio Atkinson starred in a series of comedy shows for BBC Radio 3 in 1979 called The Atkinson People. It consisted of a series of satirical interviews with fictional great men, who were played by Atkinson himself. The series was written by Atkinson and Richard Curtis, and produced by Griff Rhys-Jones. Television after university, Atkinson toured with Angus Deaton as his straight man in an act that was eventually filmed for a television show. After the success of the show, he did a one-off pilot for London Weekend Television in 1979 called Canned Laughter. Atkinson then went on to do not the 9 o'clock news for the BBC, produced by his friend John Lloyd. He featured in the show with Pamela Stevenson, Griff Reese jones and Mel Smith, and was one of the main sketch writers. The success of Not the Nine O'Clock News led to him taking the lead role in the medieval sitcom The Black Adder, which he also co-wrote 
with Richard Curtis. After a three-year gap, in part due to budgetary concerns, a second series was broadcast, this time written by Curtis and Ben Elton. Blackadder II followed the fortunes of one of the descendants of Atkinson's original character, this time in the Elizabethan era. The same pattern was repeated in the two more sequels Blackadder III and Blackadder Goes Forth. The Blackadder series became one of the most successful of all BBC situation comedies, spawning television specials including Blackadder's Christmas Carol, Blackadder, The Cavalier Years, and later Blackadder, Back and Forth, which was set at the turn of the millennium. The final scene of Blackadder Goes Forth has been described as bold and highly poignant. During the 2014 centennial of the start of World War I, Michael Gove and war historian Max Hastings complained about the so-called Blackadder version of history. Atkinson's other creation, The Hapless Mr. Bean, first appeared on New Year's Day in 1990 in a half-hour special for Thames Television. The character of Mr. Bean has been likened to a modern-day Buster Keaton, but Atkinson himself has stated that Jacques Tati's character Monsieur Hulot was the main inspiration. Several sequels to Mr. Bean appeared on television until 1995, and the character later appeared in a feature film. Bean was directed by Mel Smith, Atkinson's colleague in Not the Nine O'Clock News. A second film, Mr. Bean's Holiday, was released in 2007. In 1995 and 1996, Atkinson portrayed Inspector Raymond Fowler in the Thin Blue Line television sitcom written by Ben Elton, which takes place in a police station located in fictitious Gas Fifth. Atkinson has fronted campaigns for Cronenberg, Fujifilm, and Give Blood. Atkinson appeared as a hapless and error-prone espionage agent named Richard Latham in a long-running series of adverts for Barclay Card, on which character his title role in Johnny English and Johnny English Reborn was based. In 1999, he played the Doctor in The Curse of Fatal Death, a special Doctor Who serial produced for comic relief. Atkinson appeared as the star in a reasonably priced car on Top Gear in July 2011, driving the Kia CED around the track in 142.2, placing him at the top of the leaderboard until Matt LeBlanc later recorded a 142.1 lap time. Atkinson appeared at the 2012 Summer Olympics opening ceremony in London as Mr. Bean in a comedy sketch during a performance of Chariots of Fire, playing a repeated single note on synthesizer. He then lapsed into a dream sequence in which he joined the runners from the film of the same name of beating them in their iconic run along West Sands at St Andrews by riding in a mini cab and tripping the front runner. Atkinson starred as Jules Maigret in May Gray, a series of TV films from ITV. Thank you for watching. Brought to you by wikivd.com. Please like and subscribe below. Please like and subscribe below.